Far Cry 3 Blood Dragon isn't just one of my favourite Far Cry games, it's one of my favourite games of all time. That's why I absolutely love that it's had easter eggs in loads of different Ubisoft games, including Far Cry 4, Far Cry Primal and Watch Dogs 2. So when it came to Far Cry 5's easter egg, they just had to go one step further. Quiet on the set is the first part of a Blood Dragon themed side mission in Far Cry 5. If you make your way over to the Grimalkin Radon Mine, you'll find that it's been turned into a film set. The first thing I noticed was the massive Omega logo. They're the bad guys from Blood Dragon if you didn't know. In addition to that, there are also Blood Dragon eggs all over the place, as well as a few Blood Dragon posters. Now, this is all because this location is being used to make Blood Dragon 3. We don't actually have a Blood Dragon 2, unless you count Trials of the Blood Dragon, but I'll just go with it. The next thing you'll want to do is have a chat with the director, Guy Marvel. He'll explain it a bit more. Do you know how many fucking awards Blood Dragon 3 is going to win if we shoot this fucker correctly? <laughs> So, you'll then have to do a couple of mission-y bits, but upon returning, the director gets really quite meta. Blood Dragon 3 will be a masterpiece! Seriously, it has to be. I can't go back to working on shit like Far Cry. I'd rather put my balls in a vice and listen to everyone with their fucking opinions about world building and player motivation and believability. Oh, I'll kill myself, I swear to fucking God. Oh, and I wasn't kidding before. Close set. Get the fuck out of here. We're not going to be getting the fuck out of here just yet. There's still more to this easter egg. Head away for a while and upon returning, you'll notice the mine entrance has opened up. You can now head inside to find even more of the Blood Dragon 3 set. The director has even more crap to say here. There's even a little John Wick nod in there. Here's the scene. They killed your mentally disabled, blind, labradoodle puppy, so you go apeshit! But what's really interesting is the giant blood dragon skeleton in the far side of the cave. This really brings back some pretty damn good memories. The final part of this easter egg is the reward you'll get for completing the quest. In your costumes, you'll now be able to wear the Omega outfit. This is essentially just the costumes worn by the bad guys in the Blood Dragon games. So if you really fancy cosplaying as an 80s henchman, this is the costume for you. His name is Luke and he's more than your average gamer. No ordinary let's player. No bad easter eggs much better. Da 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 da. His name is Luke aka the Roy Gorilla. Even bigger than the giant Godzilla. Follow him in every game he goes. Da da da.